Coming up on today's episode of Airborne Unlimited, Horton HX2 Flying Wing debuts, a Vector Sports Star receives EASA certification for night operation, and Taro Dynamics receives a patent for trans wing. Welcome, I'm your host, Sophie Herlock. After several years of development, the prototype of the Horton HX2 made its public debut at Aero Friedrichshafen last week. Due to its low aerodynamic resistance, the flying wing flies farther and faster than a comparable aircraft with the fuselage. The design of the airframe makes it easily adaptable for installing new propulsion technologies anticipated to become available in the future. The prototype incorporates a blended wing technology compromised of carbon and glass fiber materials. The HX2 is powered by a Rotax 912 engine turning a pusher propeller and carries a little more than 60 gallons of fuel in two tanks. Horton reportedly has plans for both unmanned and multi-seat variants of the airplane. We'll be right back after these messages. Build and fly with the most exciting line of kit aircraft on the market, the Sonics Aircraft B models. The B models offer more room and comfort, more fuel, more panel space, more engine choices, and the same great Sonics Aircraft flight characteristics. Learn more at sonicsaircraft.com. Based on the popular Sling 2 LSA, the Sling 4 was designed to be the most practical and desirable lightweight four-place experimental aircraft on the market. Find out more about this 115 horsepower turbocharged airplane at airplanefactory.com. Sandia introduces the new SAI 340 Quattro TSO'd airspeed, attitude, altitude, and slip. With integral backup battery, safety never looked so good. See it now at www.sandia.aero. Welcome back. It's time to take a quick look at a few short stories coming out of the aviation industry in today's Around the Patch. The NTSB determined the probable cause of the 2017 plane crash, which killed commercial rated pilot Jerry Naylor, was the pilot's decision to fly with his dog. Naylor was making a personal flight in a flight design CTSW, when the NTSB believes the dog likely came into contact with the flight controls during landing. DAR has released their third version of the Me and My TBM app. The new update provides users with feedback during every phase of a TBM flight, as well as the ability to share flight data with fellow pilots and others on social media. A monument to the F-14 Tomcat is planned to be built on the boardwalk in Virginia Beach. The Tomcat Monument Association is currently taking donations for this project and has already exceeded 60% of their goal. Construction of the monument is planned for 2020. Retired Sergeant First Class and former Golden Knight Dana Bowman parachuted from 4,000 feet into the Rapiscan Systems PGA Tour event to deliver the ball for the first tee. During his training with the Golden Knights in 1994, Bowman lost the use of both of his legs in a tragic accident. Nine months later, he became the first double amputee to re-enlist in the Army. When we return, the Avector Sports Star RTC receives EASA certification for night operation. Today is a new dawn. With a new name. Un nuevo logotipo. A new factor. Und einen globalen Kundenfokus. We are Continental Aerospace Technologies and we stand behind you. Concorde's recombinant gas RG series sealed battery technology produces a high performance battery with the advantages of being pre-tested and fully charged at the factory. Find out more about Concorde's entire line of batteries at www.concordbattery.com. Concorde, the heart of your aircraft. There's a difference between charting a steady course and pushing for the ceiling. And for nearly a century, 
Hartzell Propeller has been defining that difference. It's in our passion for engineering and research and our dedication to testing the limits of performance. We are built on honor. We are Hartzell Propeller. Evector Sport Star RTC has received EASA approval for night operation. The Sport Star RTC is popular among European professional pilot training organizations and air clubs. The night VFR version of the Sport Star RTC is equipped with the certified Rotax 912S. Three blade ground adjustable propeller, a glass cockpit with a dual 10.6 inch screens, backup ASI and ALT, and night lighting package. The first night VFR equipped Sports Star RTC in Europe went to a professional pilot training academy in Slovenia earlier this month. Taro Dynamics developed a patented aircraft design called Transwing, which folds and unfolds its wings during flight. The result is a transition between a multi-copter and a regular fixed-wing airplane. Pterodynamic aircrafts are smaller and able to fly much farther and faster, carrying heavier payloads while using less energy than other VTOL aircraft. The concept is scalable for wingspans ranging from 4 to 34 feet and weighing between 3 and 75,000 pounds. Transwing aircraft takes off and lands vertically and transitions seamlessly to a fixed-wing aircraft making it an incredibly versatile tool for users that need the endurance and range of an airplane but the footprint of a helicopter. That's it for today everyone. Don't forget to subscribe and please check us out on Twitter and on Facebook. And check out our website aero-news.net if you're looking for real-time updates on the latest aviation aerospace stories. Thanks for watching and I'll see you back here tomorrow for the AMA Drone Report.